shingle tie-in. Transitions to shingled roofs are common when installing mule hide self-adhering membranes. All flashing heights, regardless of the slope on the shingled roof, must extend above the self-adhering roof a minimum of 8 inches. This means that flashing lengths will vary depending on the slope of the shingled roof. Here are the flashing lengths required up the slope based on the slope of the shingled roof. Measure up the slope and snap a reference line. Extend any nail base or SA base up the slope, but stop approximately 3 inches short of the reference line. This is done because the SA cap sheet must terminate on the sloped roof deck. Remember, if installing a 15 or 20 year system, one layer of SA base sheet is required under the SA cap sheet flashing membrane. It is best to use a full width sheet at the transition to eliminate a seam occurring on the slope under the shingles. If a seam is going to land on the slope, trim the SA cap sheet three inches above the angle change and install a separate piece of flashing that extends onto the low slope three inches, creating a six inch wide seam. Extend the top edge of the SA cap sheet flashing to the reference line on the sloped roof. Be sure that the SA cap sheet is extended three inches above any base sheet and adhered to the deck on the sloped roof. Pull the release liner from the flashing and use hand pressure to set the sheet to the slope. If possible, roll the flashings with a 75 pound roller. If the slope is too steep to roll with a 75 pound roller, the flashing must be rolled by hand to ensure a proper bond. Nail the top edge of the flashings eight inches on center and then seal with 271 mod bit sealant. Install the shingle underlayment over the top of the SA cap sheet flashings a minimum of four inches. Install the shingles so that only two courses of shingles are placed over the SA cap sheet flashings. Install any required starter strips before shingling. Things to remember. All flashing terminations must extend vertically a minimum of 8 inches above the low sloped roof. 15 and 20 year flashing requirements are one layer of SA base and one layer of SA cap sheet. Avoid having a seam on the sloped roof. All flashings must be terminated 8 inches on center. All sloped roofing underlayment must be placed over the SA cap sheet flashing. <laughs>